The double fry. Oh, no! What? Oh, your stream died. Oh, no, we dropped 1,100 frames. Hold on. Oh, no. I think it just no, re. I think it. No, it restarted. Oh, okay. Uh, you went in host mode. That's why. It went in host mode. It says exit in host mode now. Did you, do you have, like, the host, the auto host on? Maybe? I guess we've been doing for almost three hours, but no, it's it should be good now if you refresh. Yeah. The poutine has risen. Poutine killed, it clogged the internet's arteries and killed it. Is it back? Is it for you, Maya? I'm, I'm, I'm refreshing. Mm. Yeah, it's I think you have the auto, auto host on because it like it said in chat twice, like exit host mode. Host. <laughs> exit. Uh, it said like exit host mode twice. You're back though. I am? I apologize. Yeah, I'm seeing on XSplit here it dropped 1,100 frames, but now it's it's encoding again. Maybe it's like, yeah. I think I think we clogged the internet's arteries, and yeah. it had to take a breather. It's like I can't. That's what you get for not making your team when your girl is there. Well, you know, it's <laughs> not as evidence here. It's a simple ingredients, but it's not an easy process. So, you know. So mm. I want to, so like next is like, I, I kind of want to make, next time I'm there, if you want to do like a food making stream, can we make the stew that I make? Because I kind of want to make it, like you'll like it, you'll love it. Yeah, we can do that. Yeah, it's, it's like a nice one because it has a lot of like vegetables that you wouldn't think is like a food thing. Because I know that like some of the, some of the root vegetables that I use in this stew, like a lot of people are like outside of Norway, they're like, that's animal. We should, yes, I'm. I thoroughly enjoy cooking, and uh, if people are willing to to watch, I'm willing to do. The only thing, the setup was was a bit of a pain because I had to move all my whole computer and stuff across the room. And you might think, well, that's kind of easy, but I've got like the monitor mount and like the, the 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 microphone mount and like all this other stuff and all the cables. So it took me it took me a while, but I. I'm happy we did it. This has been an exceptional experience. Oh, Austin said he was doing like packing and then he was gonna have a food break and he turned this stream on and it was meant to be. <laughs> mm. So Austin hasn't seen that he lives in my apartment yet, right? No. Last gray wolf and wolves at my door. Buddies for life on a tea towel. Yeah, I'm showing it. They keep my. My mom gave me that, right? Well, you brought it to me, but yeah, I guess it. it... Yeah, it's, it's my mom's. Yeah, my mom bought it. Oh man, I'm not sure. And everybody shot like. Roo, 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 roo. Roo, roo, roo. I would love. Uh, honestly, I like. I really wish I could just make poutine for like have like a Toronto event. Get Toronto it. Went but yeah, everybody comes, we play some games, some board games, poutine, the poutine routine, 2016. Yeah. Space Wheels on Ice says, fashionable men love tea towels. Yeah, I got, mom got that. Tea towels, you know, unless you got a dishwasher. Tea towels are a necessary necessity. Wait, I have yeah, like even if you do, yeah, it's like it's good. Some things you want to wash by hand anyway, so. Oh, well, Titan has a good one. Next packs, poutine stream hosted by Fox with guests. Mmm. Mmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. We need mouth towels, that's true. We might be able to do mouth towels. Feels good, man. Like this is, oh man, and it's like hitting my stomach. It's so, it's such a heavy, delicious, 
nutritious. You know, you can live off potatoes. They got like all the basic, you know, proteins and macro and micronutrients. So add some <laughs> cheese and gravy. <laughs> I for, yeah, Austin, I forgot to put nutmeg in the gravy. See, the thing is, you don't put, in that kind of base gravy, I wouldn't put nutmeg. Although, I make this white gravy, which is like milk and butter and, uh, and flour. And in that one, I put nutmeg because I have it with fish. So, in that part, yes, I will say you can put nutmeg in gravy. But other than that, I wouldn't put it in, like, beef base gravy. See, the... It is. The layering is very important. I actually probably could have put a bit more gravy just to kind of filter down, but, uh, um, you know, again, you don't want it to be so much so that there's like a pool of gravy on the bottom, personally, but, you know. Mmm. 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 The thing that's getting me, the fries are so good too. Like, they're still crunchy, you know? The gravy has been doing its work. They've been, it's been sitting here for a few minutes, but the fries are still crunchy. Double fry, double fry meta. So many cheese curds, oh man. Mm. There's, um, uh, what is it? Society6 is a, like, clothing, home accessory website. Like, you can get pillows and different things. So, they might actually have an apron. I'd have to look into that. Um, that would be good. I would thoroughly enjoy a proper apron. We'll get a chef's hat. And, uh, I don't know. I'll talk like Gordon Ramsay. Nice week. <laughs> 50 curd challenge. 50 curd, no. As as how good it was. It'd have to be like a 50 deep fried curd challenge. Yeah. I could easily also, just. Also, Red says I drove, I drove across Kingston to get a poutine from Bubba's because of you. Really? Yeah. I've never I've never had Kingston. Bubba's, but, you know, I hope it's good. I expect. Classic says get my on an apron. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. Man, I'm kind of glad it takes enough effort to do this. Otherwise, I would eat this every meal. <sighs> you okay, Maya? That's true. Uh, also, Red said, Bubba, Bubba's was voted for best poutine in Kingston by the Queen student for a while now. The Queen students I trust. Well, no, yeah. that's not true. I take, take it back. Do, no. You need to do the poutine routine. Poutine routine, all right. I take it back, though. Northern Lion went to Queens. Mm -hmm. So I don't, I don't trust, I can't trust Queen's opinion on, on poutine. I'm adding some new steps to the poutine routine. It's kind of hard. I like it. The, I like it. Yeah, it's. I like it with a tendy bendy. The tendy bendy. It's more of a, a bendy shuffle, you know? Yeah. This is good. Also, Matt Rich asks Can I make poutine with cheese instead of curds? So that's a no. Then it's not poutine. 
Yeah, I mean, I don't know how that would work. Cheese, it's are like a, a hard, fluffy, crunchy thing, right? You get that from the, the french fries, ideally, so the cheese should be the, the softer element. I don't know. I mean, no, it wouldn't be poutine. I'm just trying to think if I would still enjoy that. You know, sometimes mixing like two really good things together actually makes them both not good. So, you know. It's making me want to cheat. I'm sorry, you know, if you're going to have one cheat meal a week, poutine is a great cheat meal. Stay yeah. stay strong, though. Mmm. Mmm. I'm enjoying this for you guys. I'm doing you a favor. <laughs> mm. As Nazero said, if you really can't find cheese curds anywhere nearby and you don't want to make them or you like maybe don't have the equipment to make your own cheese curds at home, just get some mozzarella, cut it into kind of like little cubes and uh that's that's gonna be the closest thing you're gonna get um and then you know it'll taste good i've actually done that in the past before it's like oh there's no cheese curds or they're just like a shit eating grin on his face yes you get that grin you get that grin that grin i recognize when we play board games because i know like especially when we play munchkin holy crap that grin that grin is like a thing that's always always on your face when you're like about to screw over someone Munchkin is such a fun game, and there's such a build-up to it, so... Yeah. Actually, a lot of Friday or Saturday nights in my uh, third year of university in our house, we play Ep Epic Munchkin, order pizza, <gasps> poutine... They and... have cheese curds in Ireland! Holy shit! Yeah, and, and the, the United Kingdom in general has slowly been uh, adopting poutine. You can find it in a lot of pubs in like, say London and, and so on and so forth. Maybe not everyone, but you know, Commonwealth represent. There are even places in Australia. I saw on Reddit, this restaurant made their own cheese curds and they actually, it's like, they put them on the burger itself. Oh. Their computer died again. Um, oh no. It's fine. Oh, at this point, I put so many curds, it's almost just like curd and gravy. There's a few fries left. Oh. And that's why I prefer a larger curd, because it's easier to kind of keep it balanced. You get a few fries, you get, a, you know, one or two large curds. So by the time you get to the end, it's like still balanced. Right now, you know, because of the smaller curds, it's just like... I feel bad for just eating curds and gravy because it's so good. But it's like, at least with the, the fries in there, you're like, you know, it's not too unhealthy. At this point, it's just like, like, I might as well be eating a bowl full of caviar at this point. Oh. Yeah, no fries left. Uh-oh. Nothing but curd. I do that though. Sometimes I'll get a bag of curds and you just eat the curds. Yeah. <clears throat> curds and gravy smoothies for breakfast, boys. I don't know if I could do that. Oh man, this gravy is getting a nice little gravy skin. Oh yeah, skin that. It's very, very thin. It's bubbling. It's like a little dome. Dome of gravy skin. They give 
of bags of curds in Ottawa on Canada Day. There you go. There you go. It's like in Hawaii, when you go to Hawaii, they you get off the airplane, they give you the lei. We should start giving out bags of poutine when you uh, land in Canadian airports. Mm. Oh, okay. Uh, so Declan asked, could you ask Mike to post a recipe for his gravy on Discord? You should do that in the food section. Yes. In my opinion. I will. Um, eat the skin like gold number? Oh, you're not going to do that. I don't know if I'll be able to show you guys this. It might break the skin. Can you see it? You can see the skin kind of bubbling and, and forming a little bit. I mean, I broke it just by tilting it a bit, but let's see if we can get it out. Uh, it doesn't really... Sh it looks wimpy now, because it's all yeah, like... Yeah, but you see that little skin. Okay. Yeah, I posted it it's earlier in, in Twitch chat, but I know it's long gone. We've Shindig had... is leaving, so I gotta say goodbye to Shindig. Shindig! Thank you for hanging. As I eat these, uh, these last curds, I very much appreciate. Oh, Nikki's in here and said sorry. I even misspelled your name. Don't worry about it, man. It's all good. Alright. Last bite of the cheese curds. Oh, come on. Don't be like this. I'm going to stab. Don't be like this. Stab each and every single one of you until you're dead in my mouth. In my mouth. Mm -hmm. mm. Looks sloppy, but it's good. It's so good. You know, someday when I, when, when I have like a million subscribers, we're all... Oh Well, it's hard with the fork. Yeah. And also, I don't care so much because I'm looking at a pot full of gravy that I'm going to enjoy tomorrow. One poutine down, 49 to go. That but was... I'm going to get you done this. Oh. oh, no, Birch just came in here. Birch missed the poutine stream. For this, Birch, you missed... I just finished the last... Oh. Thank you, Nug42, for the sub. Can we please get also, some some cuddles? Yeah, great, I don't know when, but I apparently missed it, but the great Jack donated $1.69. Let me do a quick, so, quick refresh here. Also, my battery. I don't want it to die. I also really enjoy the fact that Nug42 subscribed, because you know what, Nug42 is a great name. Nug42, you know, that's Nick's magic number. Very yeah. respectable amount of Nugs. Yeah. And, uh, you know. Yeah. Uh, yes. Uh, Although, I, I actually thought he was going to, like, I believe that Nick was going to make it to 50, but 42 I did, is a fucking glorious number, though. I remember the 40 was just impossibly hard, so there's mad respect in that. Um, the Great Jug did donate $1.69 and said, you may not get it, uh, get into next year's AGDQ, but at least you got a PB, personal yeah. best. There you go, there you go. Um, like the thing is, like I, like I don't think that I would be able to eat fifty nuts. Like I think I could try. Like I think I could get to like twenty or twenty-five tops. But after that, I think I would probably be like get sick. Like I, it's like a very sensitive stomach. So I think like at twenty-five or twenty, I would my stomach would probably like make me like, no, you're gonna vomit. No, I think you could you could probably get to 30 at least. I mean, it's like, that's the challenge. You get to 30, you start to feel a little bit. You get to 40, and, like, that's certainly, it's hard to guess where anybody's going to go from there. Um, certainly took a lot of willpower for me, personally, um, but also a bit of preparation. It's just, like, making sure you eat some food in the day to keep your stomach full, and, uh, yeah. Also, Sir Rapid Rabbit asked, so is it confirmed that you're going to do more food streams? 
Uh, you know what? I'm I'm not I'm gonna let Chad answer that, guys. Am I gonna do more food streams? Can we get a yay or nay and chat? Um, it's again I'm the kind of guy I'll do something if there's enough demand for it. If I get 20 people watching the next food stream, I probably wouldn't do it just because of the immense amount of setup. But this was awesome. I would love yeah. to make. Um, you know, show you how I make burgers at home. Again, we I get the, the meat, we cut it into chunks, I, I grind it. Um, you know, I think... I think, I think it's a definite yes, because people are doing the yay, or hell yeah, or oh fuck yeah, but... We got a couple, a couple of nays with Kathas after them, so I still count that as a yes. Yep. Not a single Not no. Not a single no. <laughs> nah, yeah, nah, Kappa. <laughs> so, yeah, I think, I think we'll, um um be doing more if in fact i'm almost thinking of permanently keeping my computer desk on this side of the room now be yeah, why not? i mean i prefer it over by the window over there but yeah. you know it's uh you know it's still a good good spot um so you know what i'll do it monthly or twice a month or something <laughs> i could i won't I... Oh, right. Thank you! Welcome to the Fox Den! It's super cozy and cuddly in here. And we've got poutine and cuddles. You know. And mouth love. And mouth and love. My muscles burn like my love for you. And muscles burn, yeah, get some mouth love going as well because you guys have been like super awesome tonight. I really appreciate it. And again, if like I haven't answered anything, it's not that I don't want to, I love to talk. Just, you know, cooking. I gotta I gotta do a little bit of a pat on my back. The poutine turned out a bit better than I thought just because my I'm not super good with multitasking, so so I'm I'm yeah. I'm, I'm happy that it, it turned out as well. But yeah, I think for food streams, you know what? Get on like the you know, Northern Lion has a subreddit. I'm sure a lot of you guys are subscribed to it. NLSS Circle Jerk let's get a thread going let's get a poll going maybe on specific foods that people would like to see me cook um yeah. you know i'm not i'm not a, i'm not afraid to try even if it's something i've never cooked before it'd be a fun experience to kind of cook it together um but uh yeah there's other stuff that maybe i have cooked before and i can be like this is my take on meatloaf or these are mike's well, your meatloaf is fucking baller though my yeah my meatloaf it's good. It's good uh, because I took I took six different recipes over an evening. I was on the couch. Maya and I were watching whatever on Netflix. And I was just like, okay, I like this one because, you know, it's like half pork, half beef. I like this one's glaze, you know, because they use maple syrup and this and that. And like, I like yeah. this one because they chop up and saute the vegetables first, you know. So I kind of like, I do research. It's serious business. And, it is. and then it's the true. next the next day, you get the cold meatloaf out of your fridge, you slice it while it's still cold, and then you get a nice uh, bread, or like a nice bun or something, and you, you toast it in the oven, you make a nice kind of chipotle mayo, some thick slices of mozzarella, and you just, oh, some red oh, onion. Man. Yeah. You're making me hungry at like 2 in the morning. Hey Jess, just subscribed. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Welcome to the Fox Den. Thank you for the subscription. Much appreciated. Welcome to, welcome to the Fox Den. Yes. Also, yes, uh, we, we do have a Discord. I'd like to point that out. It's it's coming. It is coming. I keep saying it, but it is coming. Right now, it's subs only. But eventually, when Mouthcoin is back... Subs only. It's when it's, when it's fully functioning, um, the Mouthcoin system, you will be able to buy access... Just with your mouth coins that you gain from just following and watching. So you don't need to spend any actual money. Um, but yeah, so that's, you know, be ready for that. And then, uh, for those of you who's like, when's my, like, ne my, next time I is in town, we should do a food stream. We're going to do a food stream. stream. Oh, Cage Elephant 4! Cage <laughs> Elephant with a 4 in it. Thank you for the subscription. Thank you, Cage Elephant. Again, much appreciated. Whoa! No way. Let me read. Get away. 
Let me. I got a hungry man in my pocket. Will you quit that for 15 more dollars? Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Um, there you go. That's five bucks. That's already paid for like, you know, a quarter of all the ingredients I needed for this. So that's that's much much appreciated. Unnecessary because you know I was gonna spend money on food anyways. But um, well, we have we have two types of streams lined up for the next time I'm in Canada, right? We have we have the makeup stream. That's gonna be fun. So. Uh, yeah, I think what we might do for the makeup stream, and by makeup stream, it's like actually like doing each other's makeup. Um, that'll be like. Do mine first. <laughs> so I think I think that goal might be like a sliding goal. I don't necessarily want to do it, but I don't want to be like, okay, when we get to two hundred subs, we'll do the makeup stream because it might be. No, a you said you said one fifty is poutine making stream, and then it says or makeup and plus additional makeup stream in parentheses. No, they were supposed to be different goals. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, but like, so, okay, well, I'll figure it out. But basically, at some point, there probably will be a, a makeup stream. But yeah. I, so like at two hundred, we'll do something else. May, mm -hmm. but like again, it's all depending on timing. Maya has to be here to do it, so, yeah. um, so we might have to push that to two fifty or something. Sub goal. I was supposed to write sub goal, but I did sub goal, or I did sub goal instead of sub goal. Uh, and then for food, I want to I want to be a part of uh, I want to be a part of food making stream. So we're gonna make a Norwegian stew, like a really good Norwegian stew, and it's gonna be without meat. But y'all gonna be like that not eating it, needed meat when you eat it. That makes it easier not having meat because one, it, it makes it for like you know a broader audience. Is it good for vegetarians too? Yeah. I don't think it's completely. I don't, it's not vegan though. Also, $10 donation from Missouri. Holy shit. What in the heck are you guys doing? The poutine has been consumed and cooked and consumed, and you're still showing the love. Food also, for stream provision. So there you go. It's like yeah. that's showing that uh, people really want to see more food streams. Um, also, I was right, by the way. Malcolm says, current sub goal, 150 subs, poutine making stream, and then in a, in, in a parenthesis, it says, plus maybe bonus makeup stream okay well i personally i don't write those moobot mouthbot thingies so but no, that's fine like i will probably just like end up doing the makeup whenever like the next time maya's here regardless maybe we'll just say okay we've achieved it at 150 with the poutine so, maya was right. <laughs> so we'll do it when we physically can do it so 200 yes. will be something else makeup has already been achieved you just have to wait so we'll do it that oh, way. Cheyenne with the six months in a row. No, oh, we got the knees. Cheyenne, thank you so much. So Cheyenne. much. So much love. So much. Thank you. I need to uh, refresh this. Welcome back to the Poutine Palace. Hashtag blessed. <laughs> I also need, you can see all the oil in the air. My hair is getting extra greasy. You're going to have a nice shower after the stream to cool down you know settle down this has been a hot sexy we got the, we got the poutine sweats poutine sweats yeah that, those are a real thing i've had the poutine sweats don't but like don't, don't even uh papa bless vape nation <laughs> i had to <laughs> oh shoot that's something here wait hold on So I forgot to turn on Twitch alerts on the actual computer. So we just jumped from 50 subs 